Yeah, Friday. I'm Coach Skip at Wildfire CrossFit, and we have got a great day for you. Ninja skills, all kinds of fun stuff coming your way. We're going to start with a warm-up still. We're going to go two rounds for quality. We're going to go deep squat progression. So really work on getting as low as possible here. Keep that chest up. Hold it for a couple seconds, and then right back up again. Then we're going to go into 10 leg swoops. So get that foot up. As you go back and forth, push out the jive, bring in the love. Then we're going to go 10 down up dog stretches, five of each, where you're getting that down dog, working on getting the calves to the ground and that head through the window, and then up dog, where you push that chest away, get that good lower back, hip and core stretch there. Then we're going to go into 10 active pigeon stretches, where you are in that down dog position, bring that foot up under you, and just back and forth here fairly quickly to get those hips loosened up before going into 10 good mornings. Just hinge at the hips, get that good hamstring stretch, keep those shoulders back, and right back up again. Then 10 high knees, getting those knees up as high as possible. Right plus left equals one on these. So make sure you just count one leg as you're bringing those legs up. And then 10 tuck jumps, really bringing the knees into the chest and getting as high as possible on those jumps. Then we've got another 30 minute AMRAP for you. It's gonna be a good one too. We're gonna to start out with a mile run. If you need to use a rower, you can do a 2000 meter row or just go about eight minutes of cardio. Then in the remaining time, you're gonna do as many rounds as possible of the following movement. So hit that mile run or that long cardio and then that's all you have to do with that one. The rest of the time is going to be spent on burning through these rounds as fast as possible. We've got tire flips. On that tire flip, your butt is down, your chest is up. As you get under that tire, drive with the legs up. As soon as it gets up to a certain point, change the level and push it over the top. If you do not have a tire to use, you can just do 10 deadlifts where you've got that barbell, you're just standing right up and right back down. Make it a weight that you can put at least five to seven reps together of that deadlift. Then we've got one sled pull with the rope. This is where you are staying stable and you are just going to be pulling with that rope and pulling it towards you. We will have a distance here in the gym. It's gonna be about 20 feet. If you need something to do at home uh, that you really don't have, you can just do some push-ups and do like 10 push-ups instead of that sled pull. Then we've got one rope climb. On that rope climb, you're going to get that rope so that it's on the inside of the knee and the outside of that foot. As you pull up, you're going to hook it with your feet as you push up, continuing to climb up to the top. Work on going one hand over the other. When you're going down, make sure you go hand over hand on the way down if you want to continue to have skin on your hands at the end of the day. And if you don't have a rope to use at home, you're going to be doing diamond push-ups where you have your hands together and just five reps all the way down, all the way up, get a good range of motion with every rep. Finally, we've got 10 odd objects, shoulders to overhead or over the shoulder. My odd object is this 200 pound slam ball here where I'm picking it up into my lap and getting that pop and just tossing it right over my shoulder. When I do my next rep, I'm gonna to toss it over the other shoulder. So just back and forth for 10 reps. You can use stones, you can use a barbell, you can use dumbbells, whatever you need, going from the ground right overhead or over that shoulder. So have fun with this one. It's gonna be good. It's a great workout to end the week. We don't do ninja skills very often, so get in here and have some fun. And we will see you soon here at Wildfire CrossFit.